Hey guys, Fuzzy here, and welcome. In today's Destiny video, I'll actually be talking to you guys about the new patch 1.015 patch notes. Uh, this is actually a really, really horrible patch for us, but uh, I guess good for them. Uh, and I'm going to be telling you guys what they basically patched. Uh, so yeah, here we go. So here's a basic summary. It says, in Hotfix 5, we've made a few changes to reduce the effectiveness of humbling number of economy exploits. Check out these Destiny dev notes to read a summary of our impressions since launch. So it says activities, uh, it says reduced drop crate of ingrams following a hard wipe fix, uh, fixed in 1.0.14. And uh, clarification, this only lasts for a short period of time immediately following the hard wipe. So basically, um, they've dropped the rate on, of which ingrams fall. So like, uh, say you were farming in that cave of the uh, loot farm. So now you get like 50% less engrams than you would normally. So they basically made it harder to get engrams uh, as far as killing enemies and stuff. So um, that kind of sucks. <laughs> uh, but it was pretty much game breaking. So um, it says Queen's Wrath event. Material rewards for dismantling Queen's Wrath here will no longer provide ascendant materials. But missions will continue to drop legendary items. So basically, if you get uh, Queen's Wrath here... And uh, you disassemble it, you will get these ascendant materials. But uh, now you won't get these ascendant materials anymore when you, uh, when you, uh, you know, uh, dismantle them. So now you just get the uh, glimmer. So yeah, the missions will continue to drop legendary items uh, like the exotic stuff and whatnot. So that's cool. So uh, yeah, it, now uh, we're going on to the world changes, destinations. So it says the hive of the holy treasure cave has uh, realized the. F Futility of their endless assault in Skywatch and have retired to lick their wounds and plan their next attack. Respawn timers from Monster Cave and Skywatch have been normalized to 40 seconds, increased from 6. Respawn timers from Monster Cave and Forgotten Shore have been normalized to 40 seconds, increased from 10. Respawn timers for Monster Caves and Ember Caves have been normalized to 40 seconds, increased from 10. Respawn timers in the Shattered Coast have been normalized to 40 seconds, increased from 10. And respawn timers in Monster Caves in the Barrens have been normalized to 40 seconds, increased from 20. So basically, um, if you guys... Uh, I actually have some gameplay on the screen right now, so uh, I don't think they actually patched this one, which is really cool. So uh, yeah, it's another great uh, cave for loot farming. But uh, anyways, they pretty much reduced the amount of enemies that spawn every few seconds. So you can get those engrams. Now they only spawn every 40 seconds. And uh, I actually hopped on Destiny today to find out, you know, uh, I, I, I wanted to get some engrams from the loot farm. So I was like, okay. And I was like, hmm, these enemies aren't spawning so freaking. And I'm not getting too much engrams. So I found that a little fishy. So I went on the Destiny uh, website and I found the patch notes. So they have patched the caves so you can no longer farm. You can still, but it will not be efficient at all, guys. So that's pretty much all they did in this patch. Uh... I kind of agree from where they're going with this. Uh, it was really, really game breaking. Uh, it really was, and it was, <laughs> it was good for us, but bad for them, because uh, you know it wasn't really bad for them, but it was just really game breaking, and that's probably why they fixed it, honestly. So I guess we're just gonna have to farm on the Crucible and those strike missions and whatnot. Uh, it really does suck that we're not gonna get as much engrams as we used to. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it in this video, guys. Uh, I have a lot more Destiny videos to come in the future. Uh, if you guys did enjoy this video, a rating would be much appreciated. Let's try to get this video to 5 likes. That'd be amazing. And uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, please consider hitting that subscribe button as I do upload pretty much daily Destiny videos. Uh, or maybe every other day. It all depends uh, on what's happening. So I'll see you dudes in the next video. Peace.